Hi, my name is Charlie. I am a singer, songwriter, producer. I would describe my music as soulful pop music with a little bit of a hip hop undertone. I grew up listening to interesting hip hop records, so I try to include it in the production of everything that I do. My mom tells me the story that um, I was three years old and I knocked my tooth out on the piano. I tried to, you know, position myself. I was so interested because I always heard her play. She was like, clearly he has an interest in piano, so I'm going to teach him. I try to listen to as much, uh, not random music, but music that isn't similar to each other, so um, I can kind of like, you know, pick and choose what melodies I can be inspired from and end up making my own song. That's how I started out for other artists, like writing for other artists and making stuff perfect for their record. I wrote See You Again um, for someone else to sing, and what you hear on the radio is actually my demo. The movie company loved my voice so much that they kept me on the record, and when they told me that, that's when I knew that I was officially an artist. I like working with a lot of different types of artists, just like I like listening to a lot of different types of music. That's what I was trying to do with See You Again, like in the verses, like when before Wiz put his rap on and we sent him the beat, there's a, like a Himalayan and and you throw that in with like a it's like you're meshing different styles together for different artists. That's how music progresses in general. Um, you don't want to ever make a record that sounds like it's already on the radio. One Call Away, which is actually the um, next single after Marvin Gaye, a long distance relationship anthem, if you will. If you're like the wallpaper like I've been for so many years of my life of wanting to get the girl, but she was just attracted to like just mean guys, it would just always like bum me out. This is the record that says that I'm only one call away, I'm gonna save the day. When I was making my album, I wanted to make songs for the album that musically showed where my life was and where it is now. There's a record on there um, called Losing My Mind um, that um, I was in the moment losing my mind because I couldn't figure out how to finish the album. And I was like, why don't I write a song about that I'm losing my mind right now? I got so much to do and not enough time. I got so much to lose, I'm losing my mind. All that matters is the music at the end of the day.